All right, thanks for staying for uh, so far. Now I'm gonna, it's my pleasure to introduce my colleague and collaborator, uh, uh, Anna Van Gulik, who is uh, a liaison librarian for sci uh, psychology and brain science and also uh, was one of the co-founders of this uh, CMU Open Science Program and also a program director. So she's gonna give a closing remark. Thank you for introducing me once again. Uh, <laughs> okay, uh, I'll be brief because I stand between us and the cocktail hour um, and continuing these conversations. So I actually um, really just want to talk with all of you more. And so I hope you'll stay and, and join us um, for yet more snacks um, as well as refreshments. I had to run out briefly because the catering was worried they had lost all of our wine and beer. They have found it. So I believe it is out there in the lobby waiting for us. Um, so I wanna say thank you to all of you for coming today. Um, I know everyone's schedule is busy. I am just really pleased to see the group that's been here. Thank you for being present. Thank you for being engaged all day and asking questions despite the dim lighting in this room. Um, and a special thanks to all of our speakers um, for traveling here and, and giving us such great ideas. Um, it's, it's been great to see. Um, so uh, also thank you again to our sponsors uh, for the event, for making this possible, uh, and to all of the assistance we had uh, from people in the libraries, from people across campus, um, from our team, uh, and from our volunteers in helping put this together. Um, we're gonna be adding you all to our open science email newsletter. Uh, there is an unsubscribe if you don't care to receive it. Um, but we hope you'll stay in touch and uh, hope to see you at some other events in the future. Uh, I promised Ben Busby from NCBI that I would do a shout out to one event in particular uh, that he is organizing uh, here at the CMU libraries in January. Uh, it's an NIH biomedical data science codathon, January 8 through 10. It will be over in our Hunt Library. It is a humane hackathon that runs only from nine to five daily. Um, and you can find uh, the link there on, on his uh, Codathon GitHub. I believe you have to apply by uh, sometime in December to take part. Um, ben was one of our speakers last year, but was unfortunately traveling today, um, but he wishes us all well. Um, and we will have many other events at the at CMU. So if you're local, um, I hope you'll check out our um, library's uh, open science program website. Um, it's on there. I didn't have time to edit these slides because PowerPoint kept quitting. But uh, we have uh, software carpentry workshops uh, about every other month or so. Uh, so there's been much mention of carpentries today if you're interested in taking part or in becoming a certified instructor. We have instructor training spots available for next year. Uh, so please get in touch about those. Um, and we'll also be hosting uh, more conferences in the future and, and workshops and all of those great things. We hope to bring uh, Lenny's reproducibility workshop here together with eLife and AdGene. Uh, so check out our events calendar there. Um, I don't know that I've had time to fully distill the themes of the day. It'll probably take going through my notes uh, a little bit longer, but I wanted to note just my biggest observation, which seemed to come up in every talk and every discussion, which was the open science community. Um, and that's, you know, we're a small segment of that gathered here today. Um, and it's a community that has many different facets and parts. So it's a community within disciplines that's coming together. It's communities across disciplines that are coming together to share data in ways that were never intended, but then can give us lots of new discoveries. Um, and then it's this broader community that includes um, data producers and the data users or the parasites, as you could term them, <laughs> uh, the software developers. I really liked hearing about how things were being borrowed from machine learning to go into psychology statistical analysis. Um, so that interdisciplinary part of open science. Um, but it's also all of these broader stakeholders that are part of doing science, right? Necessarily the funders, the publishers, um, hopefully libraries are involved. Um, and even bringing the public into it to give them access to research or to have citizen science be involved and to have a community that is 
uh, both diverse and also sustainable, that we're developing things that will last. Um, so it seems a little unusual for me to end a conference with a personal note, but it also seems very appropriate. Um, so I hope you'll bear with me and also find it relevant. Um, so I completed my PhD in 2014, uh, studying face recognition and cognitive neuroscience and psychology. Um, ended up joining libraries as a postdoc first, and I've been at the CMU libraries for almost five and a half years, uh, working on open data in one way or another. And kind of at the same time, open science has also really progressed. And I'll be parting ways at the CMU libraries, although not with Pittsburgh, um, at the end of the year, as Keith mentioned, um, to work with Figshare and, and so on some of their projects, like the NIH project. But I'm really excited that I'm staying in this same community and um, being part of this uh, open data and open science movement because it's a community that I've really found a great professional home in and I think we have exciting times ahead. So with that, um, I'll just say thank you one more time and please stay and enjoy uh, the reception. What we'll do is have uh, like 10 minutes or so for people to get drinks. Um, find their way out there, and then there will be tables set up uh, at the high tops and maybe a few other places. We'll have signs with keywords for to check out the demos or any other discussion topics. Very informal, but just a way to um, bring everyone together so we're not standing around talking about the weather, but um, can all engage on some interesting ideas. So, Bajin, is there any other note about that? Uh, yes, uh, for, for, for those of you who want to set uh, the posters, uh, come to see Hannah over here. And then for the demos, uh, if you haven't already given me the keyword, uh, please uh, give it to me so I'll uh, print it out and display on the table. That's it. All right. Thank you all.